I just want to give credit to Alabama. They came out and they I felt like they just kicked our tail for 40 minutes. Uh, even when we had the lead, I didn't feel good about it. I felt like they played tougher than us. They wanted it more than us. And I'm um, just really incredibly disappointed in our effort for 40 minutes. Um, very uncharacteristic for us. And uh, maybe it'll be a learning experience. Coach, just kind of say they may have sensed how game they go and practices were being up. Do you sense that anything kind of like this might come no, up? No, I, I, I'm shocked. I, I, I'm shocked. You know, we had looked incredibly strong. Uh, I just I just thought that they took the moment for granted. Like, we never played like it was urgent. We we played like we were up 20 the whole game. And, and I'm not sure what the reason for that is. Um, and so, like I said, I'm just disappointed. You know, we missed seven free throws in our own gym. You know, uh, didn't get stops when we needed to. I felt like Alabama out-toughed us for 40 minutes. Even when we were up 17-9 in the first quarter, I did not feel comfortable with the way we were playing. I felt like we should have been up way more uh, given the situation. I think uh, 11 for 26 for layups, close range shots. I mean, that, mm -hmm. what, do, you, do you sense it was something they were doing or was it just no, kind of I mean, we, 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 we weren't being tough. It was just one of those games, like, maybe it's good for us. Maybe it's a lesson, like, you know, we had been being tough this whole time. While we were 5-0, and we had been being tough, and then we decide to take a day off, and this is what happens in the SEC. You can't take a day off. And I, and I just cannot believe that our players chose to take a day off today. I cannot believe it. Coach, what are the emotions in the locker room right now after this loss? I don't know. I hadn't seen them yet. I just know I'm going to tell them that we can't feel sorry for ourselves and we're going to have to come out and figure things out. You know, uh, Alabama was missing their best player. And I think our girls, that, the, uh, that we may have gotten cocky. I don't know. I don't know our team to be like that, but it sure as hell looked like that on the floor. It looked like we had control of the game the whole time when I just know we didn't. And I kept trying to call timeouts, and the crowds tried to get involved, and we just did not perform. How do you kind of get the, the team and group refocused after a loss like this? I mean, we lost one game in how many games? Like, it's not the end of the world. I'm just disappointed that we lost it, you know. We're 16-3. and three. I know a lot of people wish they were 16 and three right now. We have a week off. We're gonna take the week off, rest. You know, maybe it took a lot of of us for us to win the game at Georgia. I gave the girls the day off after that. We came. We had a short practice. I thought I rested them. For some reason, we just didn't have energy. I I, I don't know. I gotta ask them, and maybe they can tell me because we just couldn't finish. Um, Maybe it was a fatigue thing. It's no excuse, though. Like, we just got beat. And, the, and welcome to SEC basketball for the ones that thought you could take a night off. You cannot take a night off in this league. And we did, and, and it got us. What kind of, obviously, the difficulty inside, but I'm just curious over what kind of, like, defensive challenges did they pose seem pretty difficult for you on that side of the court? I mean, I don't want to seem offensive. I just don't – I. Y'all, this is just a hard game for me to explain. Like, if it was some really cool strategy that I could take and say, wow, i never seen this, and maybe we need to work on this, and I would say it, you know? They just out-toughed us. Um, like you said, we were, what, 11 for 20-something from layups? We can't make layups? Like, I just don't even – I can't even wrap my head around it. So either it's us just not being tough, or it's fatigue or both. Regardless, it ended up in a, in a loss, and I'm just incredibly disappointed right now. There's no other way around it. Maya had those two early fouls, I think, like in the first minute, but then Destiny kind of came in there and uh, performed really well, especially in the first half. Just kind of what do you think about her stepping up when that foul trouble happened? Yeah, I mean, I thought that was good for Des, you know. Um, hopefully she could, she could keep going with that. I thought that was good for her. We've played without Maya. You know, I think we won like three games without Maya, so that wasn't the case. Uh, there, we 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 have absolutely no excuse. We got beat. 
Alabama came in here and manhandled us for 40 minutes. You're not going to get no excuse from me. You're not going to get no reason. No, we got beat. Nobody played well on our team. Nobody. All right? And so um, we took this L today, and, and maybe it'll help us out in the future. You know, so I, they were a net of 18. We're a net of 28. We could have really moved up with this. This was a big game for us. And, and we, we didn't take advantage of it, but um, we'll learn from it and, and take this week and come, and come back better. Yeah, what is kind of Alabama's bench it seemed like from the get-go, like you said, had a ton of energy. Yeah. and um, Just kind of what's the key to matching that energy in games coming up? Because like you said, I mean, it's only getting more and more intense from here. Well, I think it'll be a learning experience for us, you know. Um, you know, I, I everybody, you know, says, oh, we're better than last year and all that. But, you know, last year we had experienced players. We got nine new players. You know, and uh, so we got to learn through some stuff like this, and and this is this is gonna hurt them. You know, uh, we worked really hard to get fans here and come out and support, and and we didn't show up. Um, but like I told the fans, like you're either gonna be a fan or you're not. You know, um, uh, we're five and one right now. If if um, you know, I would have been cool if I'm being completely honest with us being like, you know, uh, four and two. <laughs> I would have been cool with it um, because I'm in, I'm in my pods, and so us stealing one at Georgia softens this blow just a tad. Um, but we have to learn how to take advantage of opportunities, and we didn't. And this is a valuable lesson for our team. How telling is this next game going to be? Because with this response in SEC playoff, first off? Well, we have a week off, and we need it. And Alabama was coming from a week off. And so, you know, we got we to gotta work on some things, watch film, look, our, look ourselves in the mirror, and come back and be better. Great. Thanks, Coach. Thanks. Thanks.